The nonprofit group Shoes for the Shoeless is giving back to tornado survivors in Trotwood. Two News reporter Ethan Fitzgerald was there following the tornado recovery. Well, here in Trotwood, Shoes for the Shoeless holding their third of four shoe giveaways to tornado victims. As soon as that tornado outbreak occurred, they knew they had to do something. And this is how they're paying it forward. Wednesday was all smiles as Shoes for the Shoeless, along with the Wright State women's basketball team, stepped up and helped their community literally get back on their feet. Izetta Bradley stopped by after hearing about the giveaway on Facebook. She's here not only for herself, but for several family members impacted by the tornado outbreak. This is helpful. I'm not too prideful to say I need help. We all need help. And I think this is great what they're doing to help us. Shoes for the Shoeless came with about 500 pairs of new shoes. And by 11 a.m., they had given out nearly 100. And to them, helping just one person is enough. The volunteers here make it easy and told me most storm survivors enjoy having people to talk to. And they will pair up with anybody who shows up uh, at a delivery and they'll walk them through figuring out what size they need, uh, what socks uh, they need, and then we try to make sure that the family's taken care of. The Wright State athletes helped unload the truck and played with kids who have been through the unimaginable this summer. I'm more than just an athlete, you know, I'm a person, I'm a human who wants to get involved with my community any way that I can. There will be a fourth shoe distribution in Beaver Creek on August 5th at the Be Hope Church. The time is to be announced. Ethan Fitzgerald, 5 on 2.